the way we think of dementia, you know, that we just have to have the right pill to cure it, it doesn't work that way. Think of dementia the way you think of emphysema. No one looks to cure emphysema. They just know they have to prevent it and stop smoking. So emphysema is scarring of the lung. Dementia is scarring of the brain. And I, I know I've addressed this on blogs and on other episodes of High Noon. So this new medication, the abaflabamab or whatever it is that the FDA just approved, well, it has not shown to improve outcomes for the elders. It has, um, has showed to get rid of the um, plaques and the beta amyloid deposits. That doesn't make any difference. The problem is that you know, their behavior and their um, function is not better. And then you have to worry about the brain swelling or bleeding. I have never seen something like this where it hasn't shown efficacy. It has serious problems you know, that could be life-threatening. And it costs $56,000 a year which is you know a nice salary for someone but it's not a good way to do public health it's much better and and the and the problem is that what needs to happen is the money needs to go to support a better diet you know educating people on a better diet and exercise or making it easier you know subsidizing vegetables and fruits instead of subsidizing sugar and subsidizing physical education and opportunities for exercise for the population